If you watch the news, you'll know all about what's happening at the big companies, those that are listed on the stock exchange. And you'll probably also be familiar with the challenges faced by startups, entrepreneurs and SMEs. But what about the businesses that sit in between? You might not think there's much to know, but it turns out that this mid-market, made up of a relatively small number of companies, is pretty important. The mid-market contributes more to the Australian economy than big business and small companies respectively. These 27,000 mid-market businesses employ more than one-third of all workers in the country, including 3.2 million full-time jobs. Mid-market firms make up only 1.4% of all Aussie companies, but they are responsible for more than a third of the revenue earned by Australian businesses, which is one in five dollars borrowed. On average, an Australian business contributes half a million dollars to the total GDP, whereas a mid-market business contributes $16.5 million. That means a mid-market business carries over 28 times its weight. Willingness to be bold and try new things is one of the most important contributing factors to the mid-market's growth. They constantly innovate their way out of trouble. Few would disagree that this is a challenging time. Whilst all companies face many changes, there are a few areas that the mid-market struggle with more so than any other sector. These key barriers in the way of growth include concerns about the economic environment, managing costs and government regulations. But while seeing challenges all around you might seem like a bad thing, in the mid-market it means growth. Australia's economy is a patchwork and the growth outlook across industries is varied. The mid-market presents itself as a golden opportunity to drive a more sustainable path to growth and mid-market companies that have been growing despite this patchwork economy are obviously getting something right. So how do they do it? By doing a few things very well and making sure that they are things that make a difference. For example, having an adaptable management structure, being willing to invest in growth despite a rapidly changing economic landscape, maintaining a strong customer focus, maintaining operational excellence and finding ways to innovate even in difficult times. The mid-market is the growth engine of the Australian economy. If the mid-market succeeds, Australia succeeds. For the latest insights from the mid-market CFO report, visit gecapital.com.au. Thank you.